Okay, guys. <clears throat> I'm officially freaked out. It is 10 till 4 in the morning. I'm sitting here. I wake up. I got to go to the bathroom. So I do my thing. And I lay back down. And, you know, I can't just go right back to sleep. So I turn on TikTok. You know, and uh, <clears throat> all of a sudden, I hear like the the locks on my door uh, going up and down. I said, "That's got to be in the video." I don't know if you can hear this or not, but. See if you can hear this. I hope you heard that. Hold, hold on, let me make sure. Okay, you heard that. So, I get up, I don't turn the light on that I have on now, but I get up, I look around the parking lot, hardly anyone's here, which is unusual for a truck stop. Um, so I look around, look out all my little peak holes in the, in the back here, and there is no one around, no one. And uh, I thought, okay, well, it's just me, I'm tired, you know. So I'm watching another video, another video, and it happens again. And I get up and I look around again, no one's here. My keys, I put the keys right up here because I thought, oh, okay, I'm hitting the lock button with my foot or something, you know. Keys are right over here. It's doing it again. So I'm looking, I'm thinking, oh, shit, you know, how far do you have to be to get one of these key fobs to work on your vehicle. I mean, how far can you be if someone's screwing around with me? Um, where would... There it goes again. Jesus. Now that was the back. Not the front ones, but the back one. I don't know. I don't know what the hell's going on, but it's it's ticking me off. Okay, if someone's messing with me, I I'll be so mad. But yet, what the hell's going on if someone isn't messing with me? Okay, uh, why is this going on? Why, why, my I. My van isn't on. I made sure the key was turned on. Because that key will come out if it's still on. You know? Because these kind, these kind of keys will come out of the, the thing. The ignition. Uh, and it 
when the, the van is turned on. So it's off. I don't have an extra fob around here, so I don't know what the hell it could be doing. And I don't know. I don't know. Uh, and it's dark. I can't drive because <laughs> I tried to drive last night. Tried to drive last night and I was, uh, couldn't, I could barely see the road. And I think cataracts, you know, they said I'd have trouble in the dark. That's why I only drive in the daytime. I love to drive at night. I used to, that would be my favorite time to drive, but I can't do it anymore. Um, so I can't go anywhere. I, I can't just get up and leave because I end up hurting myself because I'll get in a wreck. And I'm not going to do that. Um, I'm just wondering what the hell is going on. Now, if... Now, I've been hearing talks of the solar flare and blah, 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 and it, Sucks with the electric and and but if there's a lot of electricity in the air would that have anything to do with this I, I don't know I don't get my EMF reader out and see okay if anyone's here messing around with me light her up Anybody here? Anybody? No, deader than the door now. Huh. Hello? Apparently not. So, just for my peace of mind, guys, uh, if anyone has any suggestions, <laughs> can you let me know? Because <laughs> I am, I, I don't know what's going on. So, uh, if you guys could help me out and, and, and give me a clue as to why my van locks would be going up and down. I still have my my seat belt through the door handle so no one can really get in uh, so but I'm just curious as to what the hell is going on so let me know in the comments okay take it easy take the long way home Woo.